Hi, welcome back to Steven's Tech Tips. I'm Steven over here. You're looking at my custom built PC right now because I'm back with the other video for my GTX 1050 graphics card. Today we will be installing the graphics card in your in the PC here. Um, first what you'll need is just basically a screwdriver, but I bought this from Newegg.com and part of me it's a little bit messy in here, but this is what you get and you pay 20 bucks. I mean, it's all you need to ever build your computer. Here's your static wrist strap, everything. It's awesome. 20 bucks, can't beat it. This GTX 1050, by the way, was $100. And I get a free game, which is the, Jesus. sorry. I get a free game. Let me tell you what it is. I get Rocket League for free. I'll put another video in the description for that. You can see that video as well and see the new frames and everything. It'd be awesome. Okay. So here we go. Let's do it. Let's dive on in. First thing you're going to want to do is your you know, side nuts for your PC housing. You're going to want to slide this back and pull it straight up without damaging any inner components. This is your graphics card. I have a Gigabyte 740 graphics card in the system right now. Um, so let's go ahead and dive on in. What you need to do first is undo the little screw here, in my case, to undo the part there that you have to take off for your graphics card. Let's see here, we got that little screw out there. This should just fall off that so easily. Then you take out the screw here while holding your graphics card. You don't want it to move around a lot so you be very careful not to damage the internal components of your you know, motherboard here while we're doing so. And there's going to be a little flap down in the bottom on the motherboard where you pull that towards the top of the PC case here and that will allow you to take out the graphics card. Uh, just give me one second, let me get in there. That just pulls straight up and straight out. Here is the old graphics card. I might do a giveaway on this, I don't know yet. But I might. But here it is. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just a 740 I'm upgrading. Alright, let's take out the new GTX 1050. But first, before I do anything else around this PC, I need to ground myself. Which, sorry, is something I should have done before, but I did not. You always want to ground yourself before you do any PC work. And if you buy this kit from newegg.com, you will be able to get this ground strap for free because it, came, it comes in the case. Yeah, it's only a $12 you know, grounding strip and it's free with the Newegg purchase of your kit. Alright, now that we're grounded, let's, let's get to work. You never want to touch the motherboard of your um, graphics card because you have oily fingers. Uh, besides that, let's get this baby in. Alright, you're going to want to be careful and watch what you're doing here. Let me stand up here so I can get a better look at it. It's just that simple guys, you just click it down into place and make sure it's all in there, good to go. Re go ahead and reinstall your stabilizing screw, which would go right here. And then the only thing left to do after that is to turn it back on, plug it in, 
and install your data for it. And that'll be all for today, guys. I appreciate you watching me. Thanks, and have a wonderful day.